This is the novice timed sets workout consisting of four exercises. For each exercise, we'll do four sets with each set consisting of 20 seconds of work followed by 20 seconds of rest. I'll announce the exercises and the intervals. Do as many reps as you can for each interval while using good form and a sustainable pace. If it's been a while since you've exercised or you're new to these movements, expect to be sore. Just keep showing up. The first exercise is the sumo squat. Begin with your feet wider than shoulder width apart, toes pointed out at a 45 degree angle. Stand up straight with your hands behind your head. From this position, sink your hips back and down until your thighs are parallel to the ground. Keep your back as straight and upright as you can, and then return to the starting position. Your knees should always point in the same direction as your toes. Avoid letting your knees buckle in. Okay, let's begin. We're going to do four sets of sumo squats. 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off. Get ready. And begin. Find a sustainable pace. Keep your back straight. Ten seconds. Keep working. Go down until your thighs are parallel to the ground. And break. All right, that was set one of four. We're doing three more sets. Ten seconds. Get ready. And begin. Breathe. Ten seconds. Knees pointing in the same direction as your toes. Keep your back upright. And break. Good job. We're halfway there. Two more sets. Really focus on your form. Every time you do these workouts, you should try to maintain a pace that's just a little bit faster. 10 seconds. Get ready. And begin. Sink your hips back and down. 10 seconds. Almost as if you're sitting back into a chair. And break. One more set. Stay with me, guys. Easy day. 10 seconds. Get ready. Big in. Last set, guys. Push through it. Back upright. 10 seconds. Sink your hips back and down. Knees pointed in the same direction as your toes. Keep working. Go all the way to parallel. And break. Okay, good job. We're done with the first exercise. We're gonna take a short break. I'll describe the next exercise, which is pointers, and then we'll begin with four sets of that. on your hands and knees and you're going to raise your left arm and your right leg at the same time until they're parallel to the ground. Keep your hips and shoulders perfectly level with the ground. Return to the starting position and repeat on the other side. You want to look straight down at the ground throughout this movement. Get ready and begin. Keep your hips and shoulders level. 10 seconds. Bring your limbs all the way to parallel. And break. 
last set. One and four, three more. Really focus on your form. You wanna keep everything perfectly straight. 10 seconds. This is a great exercise for spinal stabilization. Get ready and begin. Ten seconds. Concentrate on your form. And break. Halfway there. Two more sets. You'll notice none of these movements are isolation movements. That's part of the reason why they're so effective. 10 seconds. Get ready. Big in. Ten seconds. And break. That was the third set. One more to go. Ten seconds. Get ready. Big in. Make yourself straight and long. Hips and shoulders level with the ground. 10 seconds. Limbs parallel to the ground. And break. Okay, we're done with pointers. The next exercise is mountain climbers. For this exercise, get in the starting position of a push-up with your hands shoulder width apart, and you should be perfectly straight from your head all the way down to your heels. Bring your left knee up to your chest. Now, while in the push-up position, you're going to run in place while looking straight down at the ground and keeping your hips down. Get your knees as high up to your chest as you can. Again, we're doing four sets. 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off. 10 seconds. Get ready. Begin. Keep your hips down. Keep your shoulders over the top of your hands. 10 seconds. Set one of four, three more to go. I know this is a tough exercise. If you have to break momentarily, go ahead, just get back into it as soon as you can. 10 seconds. Get ready. Big in. Ten seconds. Keep your hips down, hands over the top of your shoulders, knees to chest. And break. Halfway there. Ten seconds. Get ready. Big in. Come on, push. You're using a lot of muscles here, burning a lot of calories. 10 seconds. This is functional strength. And break. Whew. As you guys can probably tell, you're feeling this throughout your entire body. And that's how it should be with the workout. 10 seconds. You should be suspect of any program that has you lying or sitting down while isolating muscles. 
Get ready. Big in. Work. Come on. It's gonna get easier every time. 10 seconds. And break. Okay, we're done with mountain climbers. The next exercise is swimmers. For this exercise, lie on your stomach with your arms extended in front of yourself. Your chin should be tucked and you should be looking straight down at the ground. From this position, raise your left arm and right leg at the same time. Return to the starting position and repeat with the other limbs. Keep your elbows and knees straight and get your limbs up as high as you can. Ten seconds, and again, we're doing four sets. Get ready. Big in. Ten seconds. Break. That was set one of four. We got three sets left. Focus on good technique and maintain a good pace. 10 seconds. You want to find a pace that you can sustain throughout all four sets. Get ready. Big in. Get your limbs up, elbows and knees straight. Looking straight down at the ground. 10 seconds. And break. Two more sets and we're done with this workout. Good job. 10 seconds. Get ready. Big in. Ten seconds. Break. That was set three or four. We got one more set. And we're done. 10 seconds. Get ready. Big in. Knees and elbows straight. 10 seconds. Come on, get your limbs up as high as you can. break. Great work. We're done with this workout. Again, if it's been a while since you've done bodyweight exercises or just worked out at all, you're probably going to be sore. Don't skip the cool down as it'll really help with your soreness. And again, you got to keep showing up. You have to stay consistent. So regardless of how sore you are, show up three times a week. After the first couple of weeks, it'll get better. I'll see you in the cool down.